wondering where I'd be if you stayed the night They all at that party, yeah, but I don't mind Cause I bought a high pocket at the 7-Eleven Come on, let's do it again It's moving day. I, can't, I actually can't comprehend it. Um, I apologise now if the vlog is a bit chaotic. I mean, I'm pretty sure Charlotte will edit it, so it's perfect anyway. But if the vlog is a bit chaotic, moving days are chaotic. So I'm trying to do double the amount of chaotic things and film it too. So bear with me. But I want to have the mems. So... Let's go. I didn't get much footage of us just unloading because that's stupid, but I'll get footage of me unpacking and stuff. The fam have just left. Um, and I'm sad, but I'm about to go to the shop with a friend, who you will see on the vlog. Um, but this is my room. I'm going to show you the room tour before I've tidied, and then I'll show you after I've tidied. So um, stay tuned for that, and yeah. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm alone. But I need to go now. So, <laughs> this is Abby in the wild. <laughs> this lighting, this lighting is insane. I can't get over this. Um, I'm gonna plonk you here while I. I don't really know where to start. If I'm being honest with you. God knows. No idea where I start. I'm gonna start by doing this mirror. I think, and then. How do I do that? Um, where do I actually start? Let's start with my clothes. Start with my clothes. <sighs> I genuinely just had a midlife crisis about trying to get, because it's under bed storage, but it's so hard to get to. <sighs> but we're getting somewhere with the room. We're getting somewhere. And I'm just about to make the bed. Which, bad mistake, why didn't I accept my nan's offer of making the bed? I don't know. I wanted to be hyper-independent, and that was stupid really, wasn't it? So I'm going to plonk you here, and you're going to watch me attempt to make my bed. Which is going to be an attempt. I did get an offer from, from Harry to help me, but he's not here. And... I fancy doing it myself, and like I said before, I'm hyper independent. I'm so hot today. The window is so nice in here. I can't actually believe that this is actually like a thing. Like, I'm at university. It's mad. Like, what the hell? Why didn't I ask my nan? Stupid. To God. I've never done this before in my entire life. This is so cool. I'm so weak. What goes next? Sheet. <sighs> Stressful. This is like... Ugh. Mad. Also, I... Oh. Hello. I, I don't know if I'm the only person in my flat, because I've moved in on Friday, so I don't know if I'm the only person here. Yeah, I think I am. I don't think there's anyone else in my flat, but I think people are moving in tomorrow, so I'll be able to meet some flat mates, which is good. But I've got good kitchen storage, which I will show you in a bit. I deserve an award. Look at this. Look at this. Look at that. <laughs> I deserve an award. So this is the kitchen. I've probably not shown you this before, but there's not... So I chose this cupboard. This is my stuff. And then I've got this one too. Pretty much standard and then I've got this. 
And I've got this as well. <laughs> and that, my friends, is it. <laughs> I'm so past the point of, of time. Uh, what, 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 what time is it? Oh, you see, my room's my room's cleaner and tidier. Look, disgraceful. <laughs> You're like hyper. Me? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I have to admit, the lighting in my room and in your room as well is actually really good, and the lighting in the bathroom is actually really good too. Right, guys. So, fast forward a bit to when I'm actually filming this video, but. This is the room tour. I've been putting off for so long. I've, I've been, it, it's closer to December now than it is to September. And I still haven't filmed a room tour, but it's okay. You start at the door. On the right, I have my bathroom. And there's a sink. And then there's a funky donkey mirror. And this lighting here, 10 out of 10. It's actually really good. Uh, they've come with shelves already, which is quite handy, I think. The shower is actually right. It doesn't feel like it's that claustrophobic. The shower head looks like this, and it looks crap, but I can't lie to you, the pressure's actually really good. Um, and then I, you can got keep all your stuff here, which is really good. Uh, I keep my washing basket uh, behind the door because it's easy. Oh, and there's a hook as well to keep your towels on. So, moving out of the bathroom, you've got uh, a shelf above the door, which a lot of people I know use for um, suitcases. Um, but I don't have any suitcases, so I keep my dance bag up there with like my shoes, my tap shoes and point shoes and everything on, under the sun in there. And then I've got spare towels my nan gave me this week. Clean, cleaning stuff, some spare bed sheets, and then this is like um, tablets and stuff and medication. And I don't actually have any plasters, I don't own any plasters. And then toilet roll. Uh, so that's that. And then I'll pan you around to my room. It looks like this as you walk in. You've seen the B-roll though. It looks like this. My target audience. <laughs> Checkered flag, why not? Come on, hooks, 10 out of 10 I would recommend. I use them at home anyway. <clears throat> Ring light because, you know, I'm an influencer. What can you say? I actually used that for the first time today. And then I've got my Dyson Air Wrap in here. I've got some shoes and some extra dance shoes as well, like heels, um, makeup, and then just some, uh, my driver's license there for no reason. Uh, you know, <laughs> um, I love this water bottle from Girls on Track actually, um, very cool. And then I got some of my cards I got for like A-levels, some books and folders yet to be used, and then more hats up there. I was gonna, I was gonna, um put my hats up with command hooks uh, like somewhere in my room in, somewhere in my room but I think it would be more beneficial for me to not do that because it would just be really clammy and like there would not be much space because obviously it's a small room anyway so I took a lot of my hats home that I brought with me that you would have seen in the moving vlog um, so I've only kept six with me but here we are okay moving over here this is my pin board you've seen this got some hats got some picks uh, that remind me of um, my friends back home and holidays and stuff and funny memories. Uh, these are all my <laughs> wristbands from Freshers and these are all my wristbands from Karting um, and then like various girls on track things and um, from when from this summer so that's cool. Um, the desk is pretty big to be honest with you for um for Tuke, it's massive. And the desk chair, it looks a bit crap, I can't lie, but it's really comfy. So don't worry about that. Um, ignore <laughs> my breakfast this morning. Um, so I've got my laptop and iPad I brought with me um, for my work. My laptop stays on my desk, my iPad I take to lectures with me. The windowsill's pretty 
nice you can put plants on it a lot of people have like used it to put plants books and stuff but i've only just got a few things on there uh my ikea mirror that i brought from home anyway just because um like to do makeup and hair but i do recommend bringing some form of light to do makeup because the lighting is so crap and that that lamp is good you don't need to bring your own lamp but um there's a lot of storage space in this accommodation i can't lie so i've got you know the, the plant <laughs> fanta my ray-bans that my dad got me before i left for uni and then i couldn't leave home without my um <laughs> some of my trophies i didn't bring all of them but two of them from dance one of them from school and then some medals uh, actually these two i won at dance comps during uni well not with the uni but when i when i was at uni so they've been added to the collection got my car here at the moment and then some various perfumes and a conker <laughs> uh, from freshers and then moving on to the wardrobe the double wardrobe if you know me you'll know that i'm a nightmare because i have so many clothes it's a joke i moved to uni with two suitcases full of clothes but they all fit so it's okay so you get a half of it is um hanging space and then half of it is but um like cubes and i bought these cubes from ikea because i thought they, so, they were so handy so like i can organize my clothes so they're hoodies because obviously it's cold now so i just want to grab a hoodie but they're extra hoodies up there that's joggers that's my bag <laughs> and my amazon bucket hat and then this is like um underwear and pajamas this is oh trousers and leggings this is just normal normal day-to-day -to -day tops that I wear to lectures. This always gets stuck. So heavy, that one. And then this one's like going out tops, which is quite empty. My shoes, I don't actually bring that many shoes with me to uni, but what I've brought from Machine, which is the most genius invention ever, is these things, right? And you can put shoes underneath, and then you can like double stack them without them looking really messy and disgusting like how cool is that so i definitely recommend getting some of them if you're well even if you're not going to this uni but in general they're really helpful my hanging clothes these are just clothes that i don't know my favorite clothes like um f1 merch and blazers and stuff that will crinkle if i fold it up so i really hope that's not been zoomed in this whole time um so yeah that's the that's the finished room vlog guys i'm gonna go back into the bathroom because the lighting in there is really good um you've seen the kitchen um and yeah that's it really so i'll um yeah i hope you enjoyed that i hope it was useful as well so guys oh i'll take that up i don't need that um you would have seen a finished room tour i am slightly behind on like in time because i'm filming this outro before i've actually done the room tour because i haven't actually put my hats up yet but it's okay it's a scam but it's not a scam it's okay um i hope you enjoyed the room tour and the move-in vlog obviously like i said chaotic so um i was really worried i didn't get that much content but i did so i hope you enjoy that so i hope you enjoyed this video don't forget that I've got one ear out and it looks weird but anyways don't forget to like comment and subscribe go and watch the other videos that I've posted if you haven't already and I'll see you in the next video oh Charlotte's gonna actually shoot me if it's not straight okay. Charlotte please don't put this in the vlog Wondering where I'd be if you see the night. They all at that party, yeah, but I don't mind. Cause I bought a high pocket at the